And so if a blood vessel is blocked and blood is not getting through that vessel, what happens? Well, it depends, but I'd like to answer that for you. So in the case of Mr. Floyd, what has most likely happened based on our understanding of coronary physiology is precisely because he had a narrowing of up to 90% and it had calcium in it. We know that that developed gradually and the heart is fascinating in what it does. It develops what's called coronary collaterals, which means the body makes additional blood vessels so that if there's one artery that's narrow, it recruits and builds many more blood vessels to supply blood to the heart. It's actually why you are more likely to die from a heart attack if you started with a lesser narrowed artery and it, the plaque ruptured and blocked the vessel than if you started with a more severe narrowing because of all these unbelievable coronary collaterals and adaptive responses that the heart does when that happens.